Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing my 21 week pregnancy update. I just love these updates. I just can't wait to look back on all of my pregnancy updates. good I am still craving ice and water as you guys can see I do not go like anywhere without my ice and water I really want to get one of those cups that say drink more water make more milk um, but I haven't been able to find them anywhere one that I really like if you guys know of anywhere that sells those let me know in the comment section below it would be greatly appreciated another thing that I'm craving and I had to show you guys these they're the Reese's dipped pretzels and they are so so yummy um, I used to really crave chocolate donuts, but now I'm kind of out of that, but now I'll wake up and really, really want these in the middle of the night, especially before bed, in the middle of the night. Right whenever I wake up, I just have a craving for these. I'm sure next week will be something different, but for right now, it is these Reese's dipped pretzels. They're really good. You should check them out. I'm still craving just, excuse you. I'm still craving just everything um, like sweet tasting. I, ha I haven't really craved too much salty things, although the pretzels are kind of salty, but I really love fruits, all things fruits, sour candy. So I'm still on that fruit kick as well as um, nesting. I wanted to touch base on that. I am still nesting and honestly guys, I don't know if I will ever stop at this point. I started really early, if those of you that watch my updates know that. I started really early with nesting and I've been organizing and cleaning like crazy, which I guess isn't a bad thing, but I just feel the need to always be on top of everything, which is good. I've kind of always been that way, but it's to the point where it's like like naggy, like I, I get annoyed with myself because I'm kind of getting OCD and any little thing that's out of place, I get like... I, it just has to be fixed right away. Um, I never used to be like that. I mean, I'm a pretty laid back person and I love everything to be clean, don't get me wrong, but pregnancy nesting is a whole nother level. I have been waking up several times a night and it's come to the point where Garrick's even like, what? Why are you waking up so many times at night? Because he is a really heavy sleeper and normally doesn't wake up for anything but lately I've been tossing and turning and he's been waking up from it so the other day he was kind of like what's wrong like why have you been waking up so much and I don't know what it is I just can't get comfortable my stomach is to the point where it's like super tight now and it's getting super round and tight and just my belly button is getting more shallow and I just am looking more pregnant but more than anything, I am just really tight and uncomfortable during the night, which is super inconvenient, but um, that just comes along with pregnancy. But yeah, I haven't been getting much sleep lately, and the dreams are getting super incredibly vivid, and sometimes whenever I wake up, I have to kind of realize what's reality and what's not. That's how crazy that they get sometimes. So the dreams are definitely kicking in, those pregnancy dreams. Another thing that has been going on with me is I am extra stuffy and I, I think I remember this during the pregnancy with Wilder but I think what I read was that you just have extra levels of estrogen during pregnancy and so it causes like the lining of your nasal passages to swell I think, don't quote me on that but I am extra stuffy these last few weeks and it is really annoying. Another really exciting thing from this week is I have seen the kicks from the outside of my stomach, just a few of them. Um, I mean, I can feel them from the inside and I have been since week 20, kind of the beginning of that week, but now I can kind of see the kicks from the outside of my stomach if that makes sense so the kicks are getting harder and it is just so incredible I remember the pregnancy with Wilder um it came to the point where Wilder was kicking so much during the night um he would kick Garrick and it's kind of at that point now 
So that has been really, really cool. I haven't noticed any more stretch marks, and I really do believe it's because I religiously put coconut oil on. I don't put any other of like that pregnancy lotion crap on. It just never has worked for me. It's too thick for me and it just doesn't feel good on my skin. And even coconut oil, I'm weird like that. Even coconut oil, like if anything is too greasy or too like cakey, I just don't like it on my skin. So this is how I put on the coconut oil. I have coconut oil in all of my showers because just anywhere that I take a shower, I make sure that I have it because I use it at the kind of towards the end of my shower while I'm still rinsing off or whatever. I'll I'll put it on bef right before I'm about to get out of the shower and then I'll kind of pat dry whenever I get out so the coconut oil is still absorbing, but it's not like greasy and cakey if if you kind of get what I'm saying. I like say you're just putting coconut oil on when you're outside of the shower. It's really really greasy for me at least because I kind of have I don't have really dry skin. So it just makes my skin really, really greasy and oily and I cannot stand that feeling. So if you guys have that same problem, try the in the shower trick and it works really well for me and I haven't had any more stretch marks crossing my fingers. If I do get stretch marks, it's okay, but I feel like I've avoided getting a lot of stretch marks. I really think that it's because of the coconut oil. So if you guys need a stretch mark cream, try the coconut oil. Okay guys, that is pretty much it for my 21 week pregnancy update. Thank you guys so much for joining these updates for those of you that follow along my pregnancy journey. I truly, truly appreciate it and I thank you guys so much for your support. If you guys haven't already subscribed to my channel, um, if you did like this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to turn your notification bell on so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos and anything that you guys want to see, comment below and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!